This is EcoFlow's new Delta Pro system, the latest in a long line of Delta products. This one has more features and is better almost in every single way than any model before it. One of the most important features is that it is modular in design, which means that it's part of a larger group of devices that together can power your entire home or office, but also can be used alone to power a trip to the beach, for example, or camping, or a detached garage or an off-road property. The main unit has a 3600 watt hour battery coupled to a 3600 watt pure sign inverter that can power up to 45 500 watt devices that are compatible with their expose feature. This is any resistive load that is able to operate at lower than 120 volt AC, like heaters, ovens, and lights, and those sorts of devices. The Delta Pro is also the first Delta to support RVUs through its 12 volt Anderson power pole port capable of up to 30 amps. It also has a regular cigarette lighter 12 volt port and a couple of DC 5521 ports. It has an Ethernet remote control port for an optional remote controller. A new port called Infinity Port can be used to fast charge the unit using a standard J1772 electric car charging stations and also serves as a port to link two deltas together to power 220 volt AC devices in your home. Now, to do that, you will have to get two units and an optional smart home panel, which supports up to 10 circuits, it has Wi-Fi connectivity, and it's UL approved, but will require a certified licensed electrician to install it. The front panel has the same cool LCD display that tells you the runtime in hours, as well as in a percentage, and the energy coming in, as well as what is coming out of the unit. It has a typical assortment of USB power ports that all the previous versions had. Further down, we come to the AC port section where you get four up to 20 amp max sockets and for the very first time, the 30 amp 120 volt AC socket, giving you yet another way to power your RV vehicle. On the back side, you get your solar port, which is 11 to 150 volts DC, 12 amp max, which equals about 1200 watts. Next, you get your fast, slow, custom button. That's a very interesting thing because for the very first time, you can throttle down your charging. This unit could charge at a speed of 1800 watts max, but if you want to slow it down to save your battery, or maybe because you have a plug that can support 1800 watts, well, this button allows you to slow it down. But here's another thing, a hack that was found by users on the internet. The charging port for the first time can do 100 to 200 volt AC max. So if you were to plug this unit to a 240 volt socket, that means that your unit can charge up to 3600 watts and that will charge your unit in less than one hour. So not only can you throttle it down, but you can also double the speed of charging here. As you can see, the list of features on this new model is long, and we're not even close to being done. The expansion batteries available for this system are among the smartest I've seen in any system yet. The level of integration is total, and you don't have to worry about managing an extra device. The battery simply becomes part of the whole system. You don't have to worry about charging and extra batteries or turning it on and off. It just follows the lead of the main unit, which is pretty smart. Now, there's no arguing that this system is the easiest to set up and manage. I mean, it literally took me minutes to go from shipping box to connection to my critical load generator panel to serve as a backup to my building. Just like that, I'm ready for a power outage event. But what happens if you run out of battery? I mean, it's not gonna last forever. Well, EcoFlow, again, is the first to give you some of these options here. First, to charge, you have the grid, right? And you can charge slow, 
fast or super fast using that hack mentioned before, right? Now, if for some reason the grid is not available, well, you always have solar charging up to 1200 watts. But if for some reason you can use solar to charge the unit, right? Either because you can't set up solar panels or because of due to bad weather, right? Well, EcoFlow is releasing a gas power generator that's right a regular all gas generator but with the cool integration features first of all it looks just like the rest of the system you have the same screen at the front of the unit that lets you know exactly what's happening second it has a cable that connects it and you can remotely set the system to start the generator automatically when it hits a target that you can remotely set using the mobile app now in my opinion this is the most complete and beautiful system on the market today but the beauty doesn't stop on the outside the inside of this unit is full of good design execution starting with the lithium iron phosphate battery pack the use of printed circuit boards to connect all the voltage and the temperature sensor leads keeps the wire harnesses to a minimum the bms board is one of the biggest i've seen and rightly so. Not only does it have to manage the internal battery pack, it also has to manage up to two external packs. The way they combine the charger and the inverter, two of the biggest components of a unit like this into the same unit, it's simply genius, as it's the way they built all the power electronics into the same internal enclosure, allowing for a very simple yet effective cooling system. Now, why does any of this matter, someone might ask? And the short answer is that good design means reliability. And further, good design means that EcoFlow was able to keep the components count low, which means that each unit is faster, easier, and cheaper to manufacture. And all those savings many times are passed down to us, the user. Good design also means that if and when things do go wrong, when your unit needs to be serviced, it will be easier to get it done. And a good example of this is the fact that this whole device can be disassembled with one Phillips screwdriver and one Allen key. If you need to replace the BMS board, for example, one tool, that's it. That's all you need to get it done. And that is good design and it's good for everyone. Now, there are many more things that can be said about this product. This review is already running long and if it has to be summed up, well, the Delta Pro is the best product I've seen this year and is the closest thing to the coveted Tesla Powerwall. And in many ways, it's way better. It's more versatile, it's cheaper, it's smaller, it's a whole lot easier to install and so on and so on. So there you go. If you must own the best portable power pack that money can buy, the Delta Pro is for you. All the details on pricing and availability can be found on the link on the description of this video. I wanna thank you for watching this video and we'll see you on the next one. One last note, you can get this unit at a discounted price for the next two days. After that, then it goes to regular price and you can find all the details in the description down below. Again, thank you for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. So here's the cool thing about the system is that you can put this generator outside. Sixteen hundred input, three hundred from this one, and then the rest coming from the thing. And then this is what's going out. 
This is the part where I take the products that I review apart, right? I do a tear down just to see how well they are on the inside. And look, first things I'm seeing, I'm liking, right? These are a lot of metallic substructures, right? Which means that these products are going to be tough. If you happen to bang this thing around, if you have it in the back of the truck and you take a turn too fast and this thing tumbles around, you know, it's going to get scuffed, the plastic parts and maybe the corners will break and stuff, but the internals are not going to get crushed because they have metallic, right? These are aluminum custom machine. Look at that. These are high quality machine parts, right? And so this is pretty cool to see already off the get-go here. Let's take it apart further. 